First of all, thank you for dropping back on my channel. Now, I got you some banging news regarding SHIB and also the PEP token. Check this one out. Billions of Shiba Inu and PEP exit Binance in a $166 million crypto bloodbath. Now, isn't that an interesting play? I thought so. Hence why I made you guys a quick update. Now, trust me. You don't want to miss it. And by the way, do me a favor by smashing that like and while you're there, subscribe to my channel. First of all, as you can see from your portfolios, the crypto market experienced a significant downturn today, with BTC losing over 2.5% and falling below the key 60,000 mark. Now, this decline triggered a widespread sell-off across the market, resulting to an aggregate loss of nearly $100 billion to the market cap. Now, what is even interesting, amid this market turmoil, an account made a notable withdrawal from Binance amounting to $59.41 million spread across eight different tokens. The most substantial portion of the withdrawal comprised of 9,425 Ethereum valued at $30.92 million. Additionally, the account also moved over 957 billion PEP token worth $9.8 million. As well, our favorite token, Shiba Inu, was also moved and withdrew about just under $10 million. Now, the other significant token, including RNDR, token worth $3.13 million, Link worth $1.47 million. AVAX worth over $1 million and GRT token worth $550,000. Now the timing suggests that the person or the company behind the transaction may have been trying to capitalize from the lower prices as the market dropped. Equally interesting is that the primary focus of the alleged buyer has been on main tokens. Despite the plethora of fundamentally strong cryptocurrency, it is the sector that seems to be continuing to rule and board the cycle. Now tell me guys, are we now in the meme coin cycle? Two companies control the world, and yet you don't know them. When we think of the world's most powerful companies, we often think of Apple, Google, or Amazon. However, these companies are small potatoes compared to the two behemoths that are BlackRock and Vanguard. BlackRock and Vanguard are the world's two most powerful investment funds, with over 15 trillion in assets under management, roughly five times France's GDP. So how do these two companies control the world? The answer is simple. Vanguard and BlackRock own shares in all the world's most powerful companies. They are the largest shareholders in Google, Apple, Facebook, Amazon, and Microsoft. They are true financial monsters. They own absolutely everything. Pharmaceuticals, transport, banking, media. It's simple. Every time you do something, you make BlackRock and Vanguard richer. Look at T-Fund. You make Vanguard richer. You go on Instagram. You make BlackRock richer. You buy an iPhone. You make Vanguard richer. And the most terrifying thing is that when you make Vanguard richer, you also make BlackRock richer. After all, the two companies are each other's largest shareholders, 